If we've looked at the two groups of the steps of bonding, the first eight are a natural progression. They happen in the dating and engagement process, and that leads us up to marriage. The final four are very sexual and reserved for the marriage relationship. Hopefully you begin to see how this process works. If you're dating or hoping to date, take it one step at a time. Be patient and purposeful with the entire process. And if you're engaged, don't rush the process. Reserve the final four steps for marriage. Now to those of us who are married, my concern is that many of us get married and forget about steps one through eight. We just focus on the final four and actually that's not really healthy. I firmly believe that we need to go constantly through all 12 stages. The entire process continues to bond us together and each step serves a purpose. In my marriage, I wanna always be able to look at Nancy in the same way I did the first time I saw her. I want to look into her eyes and get lost again. I wanna to talk to her, to hold her hand, to put my arm around her shoulder and her waist. I wanna kiss her and hug her and caress her head. These brought us to marriage and they continue to keep us intimate and close. All 12 steps of the bonding process serve a purpose and all should be part of the sexual relationship in your marriage.